In Davis, there is a pilot program now in place to identify COVID in the classroom. The detection program doesn't involve testing students. It actually uses another method to track the virus first. It's pretty incredible. KCR 3's Leticia Ordaz is live at North Davis Elementary with more on this cutting edge technology. It's pretty impressive, Leticia. Tony and Ty, there's a lot of buzz around this and parents love it. A UC Davis scientist came up with the idea of actually testing the filtration system to see if the virus exists on campus. And so far it's working. They're trying it out at two separate schools and Davis and COVID cases have been identified early, stopping the spread to other students. So this is a pilot project that just kicked off about three weeks ago and Healthy Davis Together and the Davis Joint Unified School District are are working together on this and HEPA air filters are in every classroom. They've been in every classroom for about a year, but what's new is the testing of them. Right now, only Korematsu and North Davis Elementary School are using this special testing. The goal is to test all filters in public schools in Yolo County by the fall. Not every kid is testing and they're only testing once a week. So by looking at the air filters, we can detect if a virus is being shed in a classroom, and then we can really recommend that everybody in that classroom should get tested maybe a couple times in the next week, and we can figure out who the sort of positive person in that classroom is. And the Davis scientist who I spoke with and came up with this is really excited about this technology. He's expecting that this technology will be used not only in Davis, but throughout the state and likely the nation. And it can also be used at workplaces, maybe KCRA. Reporting live here in Davis, Leticia Ordaz, KCRA 3 News.